You may be wondering why I have a photo of the daffodils. At Labyrinth Hill, more often than not, we do our pruning in the fall. However, if things get busy, we use our daffodil bloom to remind us that we need to finish any pruning before the flush of new growth on the lavender plants. Here we are in the young field of Labyrinth Hill Lavender, and this is when we begin our annual schedule of pruning. Here's a prime example of why annual pruning is so important for lavenders. This is a neglected plant in our field that shows the signs of lack of care. It has leggy branching and it has split. When it's open like this, it allows sunlight to enter and then the weeds start developing. You'll notice even on this branch that the lavender is trying to rejuvenate. And basically the best way to handle the health of your lavender and its maintenance is annual pruning. So good pruning practices begin when the plant is young. This is about a year old. It was propagated last winter. And you'll notice there are small stems that are beginning to try to flower. At the very least, before you plant them, remove any, any flowering stems. The best way to promote root development is actually by pruning the plant to within an inch of the wood before you put it into the ground. This will encourage root development and a healthier plant and when planting in the fall, you'll have a first harvest the following summer.